Hello everyone, my name is Ebola and welcome to another video. Actually, in today's video, we are going to count on top 10 biggest reveals and trailers of Gamescom 2024. Actually, 99% of you viewers are not yet subscribed to my channel. If you enjoy just this kind of content, you can simply click on subscribe button and ring the notification bell just to gain notified for our next video. Let's dive to the video. Starting off our list at number 10, we have the official reveal of Borderlands 4. The teaser was short and sweet, giving us just a glimpse of what's to come. With a haunting Moonleaf scene and the psycho mask held aloft, it's clear that the next installment in this iconic looter shooter series is on its way. After a disappointing Borderlands movie, here's hoping the game injects some fresh life into the franchise. At number 9, we have the reveal of Mafia The Old Country. This is the first Mafia game in a nearly a decade, and it's taking us back to turn of the century Sicily. The trailer was all about setting the mood, with a focus on a room full of Mafia artifacts and a stunning view of Sicily. This could be a true return of the roots for the Mafia series, and we can't wait to see more. Coming in at number 8, Civilization 7 finally gave us first look at its gameplay. The trailer was packed with Civ's greatest hits, and world wonders like Taj Mahal, tanks battling it out, and even a nuke. While the major chains aren't obvious yet, we're sure Civ 7 will bring some exciting new features when it launches on February 11, 2025. Pre-orders are already live, so strategy fans get ready. At number 7, we got our first gameplay trailer for Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. The sequel continues the story of blacksmith Henry in 15th century Bohemia, now featuring new ranged weapons like crossbows and early firearms. The trailer showcased everything from epic horse rides to intense combat and it's all coming your way in February 2025. Number 6 on our list is Marvel Rivals, which finally got a release date, December 6, 2024. This PvP shooter let you pick from 25 iconic Marvel heroes, each with unique synergies with mods inspired by Overwatch and a storyline featuring Doctor Doom, this one's shaping up to be a must play for Marvel fans. At number 5, Starfield dropped a bombshell with an announcement of its Shattered Space DLC, but but the real kicker? A free land vehicle update. The Revs 8 is here to make your planetary exploration way more exciting, with customization options and nitro boosts to boot. This update is live now and so you go check it out. Number 4. Coming in at number 4, we got Batman Arkham Shadow, the next VR installment in the Arkham series exclusive to Meta Quest 3. The new trailer showed Batman doing what he does best fighting crime in Gotham. From grappling hooks to infrared goggles, this VR game is bringing the Dark Knight to life like never before, with a release window set for October 2024. At number 3, we got Monster Hunter Valves gave us a fresh, extended trailer showing off new beasts and regions, from a lightning powered dragon to a boar with thick skin. The monsters are more fearsome than ever, plus we got a peek at new areas like the Scarlet Forest and the Desert Outpost. No release date yet, unfortunately, but it's expected sometimes in 2025. Coming in at number 2, we finally got a gameplay trailer for Dune Awakening. This survival MMO takes you to the harsh desert planet of Arrakis, where you'll face everything from sandworms to other players. Build your base, gather resources, and fight to survive in this epic adventure. It's dropping in early 2025, so stay tuned for more updates. Choose your appearance, choose your background, and then crash into the planet. You are abandoned and alone. Hunted by sandworms, scorched by the unforgiving sun, ravaged by sunstroke. Stick to the shade, chase the moving shadows, survive. Welcome to Arrakis, the most dangerous planet in the universe. Meet hundreds of other players in the vast online world. Befriend or betray those you meet. Form a wary alliance, in this case, a spit dart rifle and a still suit for your help taking down territorial deserters. Working with others will always increase your chance of staying alive. The deserter base. Climb to a vantage point 
and prepare for violence. Your choice of weapons and abilities determines your strategy. Swordmasters lead the charge into battle, literally. Repel ranged attacks with a shield and then take them out, one by one. Deploy the Hunter Seeker and kill from the shadows. Take what you can from the Fallen. On Arrakis, nothing of value is wasted. Mine harvest and gather with your group to build bases and unlock more advanced equipment, like the blood purifier. Refine the blood you collected from your enemies to extract drinkable water. Craft improved equipment using fabricators. Replicate your bases in new locations with the blueprint system, and then sell blueprints of your architectural wonders to other players. Lead your group to become a guild. On Arrakis, a nameless prisoner can rise, construct an ornithopter, and take to the air. The world is yours to claim. This is Dune Man Keith Filari, reminding you today you're a returner with the full spy slot. My crew found a shortcut we become The in-game radio provides insight into key events happening across Arrakis. Map the desert. Discover landmarks, wrecked ships, and desert testing stations filled with forgotten technology. Arrakis is a vast planet. You can explore unique locations, uncover valuable resources, and search for secrets amongst the shifting dunes. And then, return to civilization triumphant with what you found. Harko Village throngs with people. Spice traders, guild bankers, smugglers, house envoys, and of course, other players. Here, you will pledge allegiance to one of the great houses of Dune, the Harkonnen. But remember, to play politics, you need power. And on Arrakis, Spice is power. In the deep desert beyond the shield wall, hundreds of players scour the landscape, hunting for spice. Every spice blow has the potential to become a heated battle, with multiple guilds vying for the precious melange. Even when it looks like defeat is inevitable, those who understand desert power can awaken Arrakis itself. And the finally the number one reveal of Gamescom's opening night is Indiana Jones and the Great Circle. Bethesda's does a highly anticipated action-adventure game got an official release date December 9, 2024. Follow Indy on the globe-trotting quest to uncover history artifacts while dodging the Axis powers. And guess what? It's coming to PS5 in April 2025 as well, marking a huge moment in the gaming world. So there you have it, folks. 10 of biggest reveals from Gamescom 2024 opening night. Which games are you most excited about? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more gaming content like this. Thanks for watching. Until the next episode, my name is Abolan. Peace. The beauty of a first person game like this is that we all get to feel what it's like to become indie. You are the one who cracks the whip, who feels the weight of every punch and the thrill of finding every clue. Indy is such a unique character. A professor, an archaeologist, a brawler, an explorer, the quintessential all-around adventure. And this game has everything you'd expect from an Indiana Jones adventure. Mysterious artifacts, cunning villains, ancient discoveries, hard-hitting action. It's a world of constant danger where you've got to think on your feet to stay alive. The Great Circle spans the entire globe, from snake-filled jungle temples to scorpion-riddled desert tombs. Stunning open areas to explore freely, full of secrets for you to discover. And you'll get more than just the classic whip and revolver. 
Indy's journal and his camera will immerse you in the mystery, providing extra info on all of your finds so you can appreciate all of the little historical details he obsesses over. And those details are your key to solving the ancient puzzles that hold the secrets you're after. But ancient secrets don't come easy. It's best to have an exit strategy. This is an incredible new way to experience Indiana Jones, and I can't wait for you to play it. Hold on to your hat.